In today's video, we'll see attacking cassowaries, a deadly fish that resembles a stone, and some terrifying eastern brown snakes. But let us begin our video with the dangerous saltwater crocs of Australia. Saltwater crocs are the most dangerous crocodile species of the Australian region. They're found in Australia's northern regions, they can reach a length of 7 meters, and are extremely dangerous. Over the years, salties have killed a lot of humans and injured many more. They're beasts that are patient, cunning, and clever, with few flaws. Salties are opportunistic predators. They wait patiently beneath the surface of the water's edge for suitable prey. Water buffalo, monkeys, wild boar, and even sharks are considered to be among their favorite foods. With a thrash of their strong tails, they leap from the water, grab their target, and drag it back in, keeping it there until the victim drowns. Moving on to the next dangerous animal, we'll see the stonefish. These are the most venomous of all fish and can be found throughout the northern part of Australia's shallow coastal waters. The fish is normally still, partially hidden in the bottom and nicely disguised amid the coral, rocky reef that surrounds it. The stonefish possesses 13 sharp, powerful dorsal fins that are enclosed in a thick skin sheath. Stings are most common on the feet of swimmers or waders who have gone away from the clean, sandy ground and closer to the stonefish's preferred, more complex bottom area of the sea. The sting causes immediate, terrible pain that can last for days. Muscle paralysis, difficulty in breathing, shock, and in some cases, heart failure and death can occur. Generally, people are afraid of lizards. If that lizard is two meters long, anyone would be terrified. And in our next entry, we have one such creature, commonly known as the lace monitor. The lace monitor, sometimes known as the tree iguana, is an Eastern Australian monitor lizard. This enormous lizard is the fifth largest on the planet and is Australia's second largest monitor lizard. Because they have poison in their saliva, this lizard's bite is slightly poisonous. Although it does not cause death in humans, it can cause sudden skin infections. In Queensland, a case was reported that iguana attacked an elderly couple. After being bitten by iguana, the 72-year-old man underwent surgery, while his wife was also treated for injuries at the local hospital. Sharks are vicious marine creatures and can kill anyone with just a bite. Here's one Australian native shark who's holding the flag for being the most dangerous shark. Bull sharks are the most powerful, aggressive, and dangerous sharks found in Australian waters. Bull sharks can live in both salt and fresh water, and they can move up rivers for long distances. The bull shark is one of the few sharks that can be deadly to humans, and is most likely to be responsible for the majority of shark attacks in and around Sydney Harbour. It is a ferocious species that is thought to be deadly to people. The bull shark is said to be more dangerous than the white shark and the tiger shark by some. The species can be found in murky water, where a swimmer's splashing can be misinterpreted as a struggling fish. Moving on to the next entry, we have the biggest centipede in Australia. The giant centipede is Australia's biggest centipede, and its size varies with head and body lengths ranging from 7.5 to over 16 centimeters in some species, with others surpassing 20 centimeters. The coloration and patterning of species from different regions vary greatly, with colors of yellow and orange being the most common. Insects, snails, and worms are eaten by the giant centipede. The Australian centipede is occasionally deadly, and if you go too close, it can bite you, causing extreme pain that can last for days. However, no deaths have been reported from the bite of any Australian centipede. Some people say that it hurts like a spider bite, while others say it's more like a bee sting. From giant centipedes, let us move to Australian honeybees. It's a bee that was brought to Australia in 1822 by European settlers to provide them with honey. It's regarded as one of the most dangerous and poisonous insects in the world, because it can kill anyone with just one bite. Due to its venom, the bee is responsible for most numbers of deaths, even more than sharks and salties. Nearly 33% of all hospital admissions associated with human-animal encounters in Australia are because of this bee's sting. In some extreme cases, the bee sting can cause anaphylactic shock, resulting in the death of the individual. Australia is famous for its dangerous insects like spiders, and the most dangerous of them is the red back spider. These are a species of highly venomous spiders that are commonly found in Australia. Found in the urban areas of Australia, the female red backs have a red stripe on the back side of their upper abdomen and are the most dangerous. Around 2,000 red back spider bites are reported in Australia each year. Though the spiders are not very poisonous, the bite can cause a lot of pain. The most common symptoms are extreme sweating, muscular weakness, vomiting, and nausea. The redbacks are capable of catching small lizards in their webs, and these spiders are also good at stealing packed food from other webs. We can't imagine if we had to live with dinosaurs, and how we would have survived. 
In the next entry, we're going to show you a bird that looks like a modern-day dinosaur, a cassowary. A big flightless black bird, the southern cassowary is also known as the Australian cassowary. The cassowary is a ratite, which means it's linked to emus, ostriches, rheas, and kiwis. Cassowaries are naturally afraid of humans, but if provoked, they may cause significant, even fatal, damage. The cassowary has been called the world's most dangerous bird numerous times. Attacking cassowaries charge and kick, sometimes jumping on top of the victim. They can also peck or headbutt. The cassowaries often cause puncture wounds, lacerations, and bone fractures to its victims. Cassowaries are known to be dangerous, and they're the only birds known to have killed humans, along with ostriches. Golden orb weaving spiders are large spiders with silvery gray to plum-colored bodies and brown-black, often yellow-banded legs. Orb spiders can be found in Australia's dry open forests and woodlands, as well as coastal sand dune, shrubland, and mangrove environments. The golden orb weaving spiders build large, semi-permanent orb webs. The silk has a golden gloss to it. These spiders stay in their webs throughout day and night, and they have a barrier network of threads on one or both sides of the web that provides considerable protection against bird attacks. The weavers are hesitant to bite and don't bite a person unless it gets way too close. If a person is bitten, the symptoms are mainly a little local pain, numbness, and swelling. A bite might cause nausea and dizziness in some people. Most people in the world fear snakes, and Australia is home to the two most dangerous snakes in the world. Number one, the eastern brown snake. The eastern brown snake, also known as the common brown snake, is a highly poisonous snake that's found throughout eastern and central Australia. The adult eastern brown snake is thin and may reach a length of two meters. Eastern brown snakes are fast moving, aggressive, and notorious for their bad temper. They survive in inhabited places, notably on farms and rural regions with mice, and its venom is classified as the second most poisonous of any land snake in the world. When disturbed, the eastern brown snake raises its body above the ground, twisting into an S form with its mouth gaping open and ready to strike if disturbed. Its venom causes gradual paralysis, which might take a long time to cure. Victims pass out in a matter of minutes after the bite. The coastal taipan, also known as the common taipan, is a highly poisonous snake that is native to northern and eastern Australia's coastal areas. The coastal taipan is Australia's second longest poisonous snake, measuring roughly 2 meters in length on average, with the longest specimens reaching 2.9 meters. The coastal taipan mostly hunts and consumes small animals, as well as birds when the opportunity arises. It has the largest fangs of any Australian snake and has the third most poisonous venom of any land snake. When surprised or cornered, they put up a ferocious defense, freezing before flinging their lightweight body forward to inflict a series of lightning-fast snapping bites. The venom has an effect on the neurological system and the blood, causing nausea, convulsions, internal bleeding, muscle damage, and kidney damage. Death can happen in as little as 30 minutes in extreme situations. Like the coastal taipans, the rays of Australian waters are also very dangerous. There are 630 species of rays in the world, but the most famous of them are found in the Australian waters, and that's the stingray. Stingrays have been around longer than the dinosaurs. They're friendly until you step on them. The rays have a serrated spine on their tail, which is venomous, and they use it for defense purposes. These rays can grow up to 7 feet and can weigh 250 pounds. Hundreds of incidents of stingray attacks are reported every year in Australia. And now let us move on to our subscriber pick of the day. This image was sent to us by a subscriber. Similarly, if you ever wish to know more about an image you come across, just send it to us. Who knows, we might even feature it in one of our videos. Today's subscriber pick is a picture of a snake with three heads. This picture came from a small town in India and broke the internet. The local news agency said that this picture is fake and no such incident was reported in the town. We can say that it's just good editing and nothing else. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.